Rachel Gibson, like many working mothers, wants to feed her children the best food she can find. So for this snack, she chooses organic food in a glass container. But I'm pretty certain that the that the cap, the lining in this top part has probably has bisphenol A in it because um, there's some sort of epoxy that's used for that. Her concern is legitimate. Bisphenol A or BPA has been linked to breast and prostate cancer and other diseases oh, yeah. in animal studies. BPA is widely used in plastics and epoxy resins, including the lining of food cans. It has been identified as an endocrine disruptor, which means it affects glands and hormones. The Breast Cancer Fund works to eliminate environmental health hazards that cause cancer. The group released a report showing high levels of BPA in canned food marketed to children. Connie Engel is with the Breast Cancer Fund. The Breast Cancer Fund tested popular canned food items marketed to kids and found that every single one contained BPA. The highest levels were found in Campbell's Disney Princess and Campbell's Toy Story soups. Engel says BPA in the can lining migrates into the food. Dr. Lina Hilakivi Clark is a researcher at the Lombardi Comprehensive Cancer Center at Georgetown University. She says animal studies show a direct link between BPA and breast cancer. Basically, over 90% of humans, when we measure or the BPA levels are being measured, are positive. So one can find uh, levels of BPA in most uh, people. Dr. Hilakivi says cancer can take 50 years to develop. She's more concerned about type 2 diabetes in children and notes that BPA affects children and adults differently. I think that in both um, there is an increased risk, for example, for type 2 diabetes, but children in general are much more susceptible for exposures, endocrine disruptor exposures, and most uh, um, sensitive are pregnant women and their um, unborn fetuses. Besides cancer and diabetes, other studies have linked BPA to infertility, early puberty in girls, and obesity. Many of the medical findings on BPA have been contested and studies continue. Some U.S. states have banned BPA in baby bottles, children's toys, and utensils. A spokesman for Campbell's, the company with the highest BPA levels in the study, has said it is confident in the safety of its products. He said evidence shows BPA in canned linings poses no threat to human health. Anis, another company cited in the study, says it is looking for an alternative to BPA. This is Sulima Palacio, VOA News.